In this video, we will find the derivative of the function y is equal to 1 upon square root of ax plus b. So first we will take, differentiate both sides with respect to x. So we have dy by dx is equal to d by dx of 1 upon the square root of ax plus b. And this can be written as now first we can see that we have the formula d by dx of x to the power n is equal to n times x to the power n minus 1. But we cannot apply this formula over here directly. So first let u is equal to ax plus b. So the derivative dy by dx is equal to d by dx of 1 upon square root of u. And this can be written as d by dx of 1 upon u to the power 1 upon 2 because square root of u means u raised to the power 1 upon 2 and then d by dx of u to the power minus 1 upon 2 but we cannot apply the power rule of differentiation over here because these two variables are not same over here so we must have du in place of dx so first we will write d by du and then multiply it by du by dx in order to balance this thing and this is called the chain rule of differentiation. Now we can apply this formula because these two variables are same. And we can see that we have minus 1 upon 2 in place of n. So we will put minus 1 upon 2 over here and over here. So first we will write minus 1 upon 2 u to the power minus 1 upon 2 minus 1. Multiply by the derivative of u and u is ax plus b. Now this will become 1 upon 2 u raised to the power minus 3 upon 2 and uh, here we know that the derivative of x is 1 and the derivative of any constant is 0. Now here we will apply the derivative on both the terms so we have d by dx of ax plus d by dx of b and this can be written as minus 1 upon 2 u raised to the power 3 upon 2. Now this a can be written before d by dx and the derivative of b is 0 because the derivative of constant is 0 and then we put back the value of u which is ax plus b whole power 3 upon 2 and a times the derivative of x is 1. Plus 0. So we have a times 1. And the final answer is minus a upon 2 times ax plus b whole power 3 upon 2. 